I was talking to a friend about Pinoy art and he mentioned about how local paintings tend to be too tight for every square inch has to be filled to the brim. It took me a few seconds to rewind all the paintings I could think of before I said, that's right, I never realized that. And then I chanced upon the book on Philippine art that gave it a name, Horror Vacui. It's a Latin phrase that describes our aversion to empty spaces or fear of open black spaces. Here are some examples. Do you feel like you need a screen break? Again, I never realized this characteristic of Pinoy art until it was pointed out to me. But know what? I like it. It's like you're getting your money's worth when the entire canvas has been touched by the artist. But seriously, what I love about this type of works is that they're fun, a la Worst Wally or Larry Alcala's Slice of Life. There's that element of ui when you see something. Horror vacuum works demand more time and effort and engagement for a full appreciation. Of course, we're not expected to spend an hours to study the painting. We can stop after one or two discoveries and then return another time. The painting then takes on a magical aspect because it reveals something you didn't notice before. Pinoy art authors attribute the horror vacuum tendency to our way of life. We are so used to succeed than basta may space lang. We see that in jeepneys, which, by the way, are not spared from horror vacui either with how they are painted. We also see the principle in horror of horrors in the classroom and in the LRT. It's in the Pinoy DNA, which perhaps explains why the authorities went all out in their strict implementation of social distancing in 2020, because Pinoy's feel a space has to be occupied and filled and filled to the brim. We also apply the horror vacuum principle when we go for all you can eat but with no leftover buffets. But other than it's our way of life, perhaps it's also a matter of gaya gaya without thinking attitude. You see paintings done like that, so you paint or buy works like that. But of course, this is not to say there are no noise paintings that give us visual space. There's something for everybody in Pinoy art. Variety in Pinoy art is essential. Art is essential.